Welcome back. So she's playing in a theater near you, and this one is a real hoot. Meet Maleficent, the great horned owl from the Kansas City Zoo. Sean Putney with the zoo is here to introduce us to this beautiful creature. Isn't she precious? She yeah. is. I was just saying, she is Queen Maleficent, and Angelina Jolie surprisingly has nothing on her. Right. If you haven't been to one of our bird shows, now's the time to come. And she's not in every one of our shows. We okay. switch birds up. but. Um, we have a little cute Halloween program that goes on uh, 10.30 and 11.30 every day, and you can see Maleficent and some of her friends fly around. You can really get a better idea of really what these birds uh, have to offer, how they get around. We do have them flying in the auditorium, so it's, it's pretty neat for kids of all ages. So that answers one of the questions. She can obviously fly. Yep. yep. Wonderful. Now, where did her name come from? Because this is a Disney villain name. Uh, it is, but it, you know, <laughs> if you watch the movie, you know, they give her a little bit of a softer okay. touch. So, um, you know, I think that's when we first got her. I think that's when the first movie came out. So mm -hmm. that was uh, one that's of the reasons for thing. it. Right, right. Just like the timing is for Hoots and Howls and for the movie release, it's perfect. Right, right. So uh, you mentioned Hoots and Howls. Mm -hmm. So Hoots and Howls will be happening this weekend. If you haven't come out, you know, really cool stuff for the kids. You know, you can get on the the tractor rides and. You can go through the hay mazes and they have DJs out there and little arts and crafts stuff. So it's a lot of fun. And then in a couple of weeks, you can get your costumes on, come out for Boo at the Zoo and uh, do some uh, trick or treating at the zoo in, in a safe environment. Okay, now I noticed Maleficent's awfully close to you. Do you think we could slide her out a little bit so we could get. Oh, she's making some noises too. How about that? She's kind of been hooting throughout the show. You know, does that mean she's excited? Well, she she gets a she feels a little bit more protected when she's up against in, in a new environment oh, when she's really? up against me. But okay. you know you can get a better view of her feet. Uh, and she's got hair on her feet. That's it, wonderful. And really, her her head you can see how she moves it around almost 270 degrees. How they can move their heads around. Did you say 270 degrees? Right. So that's like far more than halfway around. They have huge eyes, so they're great predators. They they use those eyes to be able to focus in on the prey that they're going after. She's so very talented, guys. Very, very. <laughs> okay, now let's also talk about some of the things that you have coming up because Halloween season is in full force at the zoo. Yeah, and uh, you know, ordinarily we're talking about a family-friendly place, so yeah. tomorrow night is uh, our brew at the zoo. That's for adults Ooh, only. Tell me more. We still have tickets available. We have over 40 uh, local breweries that are bringing their wares to the zoo so you can taste them. Uh, we have some wines too so you can walk around the zoo. It's really a fun event. It's been building over the years. Uh, now we usually have a, a couple thousand people who come and attend. Uh, we'll have bands there, we'll have food trucks there, so it's really a lot of fun. Oh, that sounds amazing. So let's also ask, can she fly silently? Because this was something that I think I, I read somewhere. Yeah, that's the thing about owls. One of, the, one of the neat things that they have to sneak up on their prey items is they can fly. You know, it's not exactly silent, but it's very hard to hear them coming. Ooh, okay, now one last thing before you go. We talked about brew at the zoo. What about boo at the zoo? So, back to family friendly. So this is for kids of all ages. Mm -hmm. So not this weekend, the following weekend on the 26th and 27th, you can dress up in your favorite costume, oh, come so trick fun. or treat at the zoo, have a good time, again a safe environment. Uh, lots of people usually come and, and uh, it's, a, it's a lot of fun to see the, the animals of uh, uh, dress up that are outside the exhibits. So cute. Well, thank you so much, Sean, and of course, Maleficent, for stopping by the studio. Thanks for having us.